any margins away to third parties. We try to use our own money for financing of other parts of the business. So let me just go through the figures just to get sure I understand this. Your company skims 3% of the turnover, not of the profits, 3% of the turnover of all the franchisees. That's a lot of money. That money flows to the Netherlands and onwards to, for a significant part of it, to uh, the Interrogo Finance SA in Luxembourg, one third of it, and there's another big chunk uh, to other charges to undetermined beneficiaries. Can you just explain me why you did that whole construction uh, through Netherlands, Luxembourg, and Liechtenstein? What have these countries special that you vested these financial conduits there, if not very nice uh, tax uh, provisions in their laws? The 3% of turnover that is paid in franchise fee by all franchisee is not skimming of profits. This gives all franchisees around the world the right to sell IKEA products in IKEA stores under the IKEA concept. It gives them the possibility to do business and pay significant taxes in their countries. The franchisor, which is into IKEA Systems BV, is in the Netherlands since 1983, is the final receiver of the franchise fee. The inter IKEA group, which I represent, correctly, as I stated in earlier, pays 15.5% in consolidated taxes. We are on a journey also to clarify and simplify our structure. Puisqu'il y a eu effectivement, un, il y a eu un rapport très, très documenté, très précis, qui a été présenté sous l'autorité politique du groupe des Verts. Ce que je propose, c'est qu'IKEA fasse une réponse écrite en indiquant quels sont les points qui lui paraissent exacts, quels sont ceux sur lesquels IKEA conteste. 